still getting used to an empty home greeting me. Feels good to be back home. I was looking forward to being home all day. A responsible adult would have hung it up, but I guess that's not me. Let's see what's in the fridge. Okay, what should I eat? Ooh, we have some chicken here, maybe? Okay, that's definitely what I'm craving. Boneless chicken chunks, pinch of kosher salt, a healthy crackling of black pepper, soy sauce for umami and aroma. And a little bit of booze won't hurt. Make sure to massage it well, with love. Now we want to preheat our oil while the chicken marinates. Get a heavy duty Dutch oven and neutral oil to fry. Halfway mark will do. It's game time doobies. For the batter, it's going to be pretty simple. It's going to be 50% AP flour and 50% potato starch. For one chicken, I ended up putting quarter cup each. Putting things away so my future self loves me. Again, massaging with love. Uh, why is this weirdly sexual? You want the chicken to look like it has eczema. Once the oil is up to temperature around 170C, drop it in gently, like a baby in a pool of hot oil. Agitate it so it doesn't stick. And once it's golden, take it out of the oil onto a wire rack. That's all. JK, you know my Angdangi eats more than that. Let's up the temperature. Strain the traders. I'm going in tonight. RIP that. I'm too old to be doing this, honestly. But seriously, double frying at a higher temperature makes your chicken shatteringly crunchy. Don't forget about your second batch because I almost did. Wipey wipey, future me lovey lovey. You want to salt it immediately when it's hot out of the oil. That way, the salt adheres on. So moist, juicy, and tender, just like your lips. Mm. It's time for pleading. Nah, this way is prettier. Japanese mayo and a couple wedges of lemon for a hint of acidity Music is a must 
It's all about ambiance, babes. Time to eat. Honey. This is one of my favorite beers, by the way. Golden like the color of pee when you didn't drink water all day. <sighs> Pure bliss. Not piss. I'm basically Korean Eminem. <laughs> You would too, if you made it. Okay, I'm done. Chaos reigns. I don't even think a commentary is necessary for this. There's just no there's just no words to describe how good it is. You just have to try and make it, I guess. I'm literally a god. JK, I'm a piece of shit, but still. This was godly. Washing it down with some cold beer. <sighs> oh my god. This is so good. <laughs> okay, let's talk. It's been a while since I've sat down and just kind of ate with you guys. The uglier the better, you know, that's what I say. And for the batter, it's not really a batter, it's kind of more of a dry mix. I like using 50% potato starch and then 50% AP flour. That way it has like that kind of nice scraggly texture without falling apart um, and it adheres to the chicken really, really well. So yeah, 